Okay, a follow-up video from my last one. Um, one thing is I cleaned up this menu a bit, so there's not a lot of different options that were here before. Like here before, um, and with a lot of the options giving me 590k, there's a, there was a lot of duplicates that weren't needed. In fact, I mean these two things are basically only here um, for the sake of how long the uh, boot process actually takes. Um, I mean, booting into UMB only, it doesn't take that long. Uh, and then you know, Microsoft Network, and then it's like we're down here. I'm pressing F5, give you 580K, even though nothing should have given me five. I don't know, I guess there's variables or whatever. But the most one that I'm going to be using is going to be up here, 590K. And um, so that's that's that. Just loads the UMB and yes, it loads something else here. We have a VGA BIOS. Um, this loads VVFix uh, on startup, and so VVFix. Um, you know, this is documentation from the uh, other machine and um, the other machine when this you know the board was in there with when this VGA card was in there. Um, he did have it in the auto exec batch file, um, but it was remmed out, so I guess he thought he didn't need it or whatever. Um, but there is stuff that will. So let's, like I said, this is a continuation from last one. I do not uh, leave things lie if I believe that I can get it work working. Um, so Wolf 8086. Um, We'll run this, and I disabled the, the music on this, and just uh, hold, bear with me for a bit. Um, so, this is the version that I was running before, the one that is for an 8086 processor, or thereabouts. And I have set the screen size to at 8. That might be a little too big, but um, let's do a new game. And whatever, I'm not going to be playing through a lot, obviously. See how long this takes? I mean, that loads pretty fast, honestly. I mean, it's, it's better than I thought it would be. Um, and let's... So I mean like this is this is what it looked like before. I mean it's not that uh you know, it's 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 a uh, pretty good. And actually kind of funny thing is I I did a uh, I uh, a top bench on this or not a top bench. And I can't, yeah, I can't really play it that well, but yeah, I mean, like, scrolling, it's, you know, that's working. Oh, yeah, 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 the Super, uh, super Scope something, it went to 1.5 uh, frames per second on that. <laughs> but yeah, uh, we're walking around, this looks pretty good. I mean, there's not a lot of not happening. So let's exit this, because I showed you before that this actually does work, so nothing changed on that part. Um, so we'll go to quit and uh, well look at that VV fix thing hey I'm back to the prompt and how about this V20 with the floating point and a V20 or V30 optimized there we go for some reason thinks I have a sound source now uh, on this version that's not a huge deal but yeah all right this might feel I mean the loading thing that's it's not bad I don't know I mean if, if you want to like time it I don't know I don't know how to benchmark this there's no benchmark for <laughs> 
Uh, so this is going to have the same uh, eight, the size of eight. So we can do a new game. No sound. Just to give it its best. Uh, I am not going to be shooting a lot of Nazis today. Uh, this is was that faster? Is that faster? So yeah. Honestly, I can't really tell a huge difference if there is any. This might this might be a little faster, but I mean it's still not great. And when I was saying about like Enki rollover or anything before about this keyboard, man, these Nazis are dumb. Oh! Ha <laughs> ha. Um, not just these Nazis. All Nazis. Anyway, um, what was I getting at? Yeah. Also, yeah, this is, uh, I don't know. I, I, I can you tell the difference? Is, is there much of a difference? Um, I'm going to have to replay the video, I guess, do it side by side, maybe, I don't know, but yeah, um, that is the, so I know the, it, it recognizes the 8087, obviously, and, uh, yeah, it wasn't an issue where it's explicitly looking for a V20, um, it's just a ROM fix that apparently it needed. And like I said before, this thing uh, also closes out and gets me to a prompt again. So, you know, good deal. And just for those who say, it's like, oh, did you just copy and paste? Like, this is this is not smoke and mirrors. This is the actual other executable that's working. The other one had the cheat quit thing, uh, cheat menu there. This one doesn't. And this one uh, also... Uh, yeah, sees a sound source for whatever. But anyway, that is basically all I wanted to say. I got it working, um, and the V20 fixed, and the V... Anyway, that's it. That's all. Have a good one.